Friends, buddies, pals, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to a Friday filler. It's me. It's Irvin. This is going to be a pretty quick one, but it's just something I wanted to touch on. And it kind of links to a video I made a few weeks ago on what safety gear I take with me into the backcountry. And if you haven't seen that, I'll link that up here and you can go check it out. So I had this sent up to me to have a look at. It kind of links up quite nicely. And this is this care kit. So you may or you may not have seen this Kickstarter program knocking around on Instagram and Facebook. The guy behind this, Matt, he sent this up to me. Thought I might be interested in taking a look at it. Like I said, it's a Kickstarter program. It's a prototype model that I've got, so it's not complete, but I did get to have a look at it and thought I'd tell you what I thought. I like the idea of this. I think the concept's really, really good. As in, everything's in this case. It kind of covers your shelter, your first aid, and some basic kind of multi-tool, gadgety stuff. I like the fact you can have everything in one place, easily grabbable, takeable, you know, wherever you go. I'll open it up, I'll show you what's inside, talk about it a bit, you can make your own mind up. This is what it's in, it's in this kind of, I think the material's a bit different, uh, or it's gonna be a bit different. So I like the fact you can unzip it, and inside, it's technically, kind of has your bases covered. So you have a shelter pouch, you have a tool pouch, and you have a first aid kind of pouch. Also in the side, down the side here, there's a little water straw, like a, you'll see my life straws that I use, it's similar to that basically. Each of these you can take out, so this is the shelter pouch. Now in here, well there's supposed to be a tarp, but uh, he's ran out of tarp, so I don't have a tarp. So I have some, uh, I have some pegs and I have some paracord. I, I like this idea, I've been talking about getting a tarp for probably the last season now, and I haven't got around to it yet so I like this idea uh, even if you don't want to take anything else that will just slide in your bag nicely you've got a tarp you've got a bit of shelter in case you get stuck in case it starts raining in case you can't make it home so that's a great idea and the tall thing here now I'm not going to go into detail on all this because it's just very boring otherwise but basically in here you've got a few things you've got a you've got a compass you've got a signal mirror a fire starting kind of kit some tinder and a fire starter in there you've got a headlamp and then you've also got like a little multi-tool thing and some attachments, you know, knife, um, kind of pliery stuff, that kind of thing. I like the headlamp, I like the fact that that's rechargeable as in like you plug it into a USB port and you can recharge it rather than swap batteries out. This is your, basically, it's like a life straw, it's just a water filter straw. Um, I use a life straw, so I probably won't use that, but I like the idea, I like the concept pretty handy thing to have even if you took that out and just threw that in your pack as it was or like I do I keep mine in the bottom of my hip pack I think it's a, it's a really handy thing I've used them a lot now the first aid kit there's some plasters there's some alcohol swabs there's some kind of bits of tape there's some some scissors and an emergency blanket a couple of bandages again if you don't want to take everything you could just take these little pouches out throw it in your bag and away you go in a nutshell that's what you've got the idea is you've got your tools, your first aid kit and your shelter, all covered and all in one place. Like I said before, I like the concept of this and the fact that you can have pretty much your basics covered in here. You can throw that in your truck, you can throw that in your boat, you can throw that in your bag if you've got a big bag. I'd say if you don't have anything in place, and you should by the way, everyone should have some kind of first aid kit, backup plan, survival stuff, fire lighting things with them whenever they go onto the river, especially if you're going a long way, this would be a really good place to start. It has your bases covered. If you want to become a bit more specialized and tweak things a bit more, at least you've got a good base to build on it. You can swap things in, you can swap things out, and you can make it a bit more personal and a bit more suited to exactly what it is that you do. And that's probably what I will do with this, is just kind of tweak it to what I like. So I'll leave a link in the description below to the Kickstarter page link and you can go and check out this in a bit more detail tells you a bit more about what's in there that's it guys i'm going inside because it's super cold and i'll see you on wednesday we'll go for a fish peace